Hello everybody, my name is Tokreva and welcome back to some more Endless Legend. Playing as the Wild Walkers, let's just straight up end our turn. Currently building another burrow in our capital city and you need it does cost a lot of production. But the city just grew to size 3 which shaved off another 2 turns off of it. Um, this village is hostile and can represent a threat. Um, the tribe has identified their lair in the temple ruins, which are alright. We are moving that way though, that's the thing. That's true, we were going this, that way. And here we have a enemy capital of the... Um, Ardent Mages that we encountered, Red Faction, MOL. Uh, it is their capital as well, but we're on our way to these Temple Ruins, which is actually another ruin. What, what's... Why does that have a exclamation mark? I have no idea. Actually, first time I see this in the game, and I have spent a couple... And it's gone. Okay, let's move in more and search this one you've been trapped survive if possible but more important make sure the monsters are all killed ah yes we have one demon and two driders um the demon is the main problem here the driders are not that strong so if we could let's see um yeah, we do have three ranged units, which is in itself useful. So I think deployment, if I were to go a little bit further north, that should be fine. Our hero as well. He's already level 2, gets 4 experience per turn. Let's say ready, and we need everyone to focus down the flipping demon. Has 168 health. Uh, 43 attack. We have decent attack, but the problem is we also haven't got that much uh, hit points either. But the usefulness is we are ranged, so we could kill them in two turns or so. We have quite a large range, actually. Ah, yeah, they can now hit this. And that does a lot of damage. They're almost dead now. Um, oh, of course, they are going to heal. Heals up for 34. Um, can I not order them to go there and then attack? No. Okay. Um, commands, you need to hold its position and attack only when in range. Oh, well, we're probably going to lose this one ranger already. I'd rather just try and kill the demon. Oh, that's 48. Oh, they do have a high bonus for being up close, I think. Yeah, point blank power. They're just... Oh, really? Are you going to do this? Means they still kill this guy and do... Oh. No, wait. They didn't kill them? Oh my god. They're all at one hit point. Please don't... No oh, good, you're not healing the demon. Um, yeah, so you guys are going to be retreating back before, and you are just going to straight up attack him. Oh no, hang on, I need to attack with one because of initiative. But one, the further forward most will be retreating at the least. Oh, they can still attack, which is very good. Good job. We'll be moving a bit further forward to attack as well. Of course, low initiative on these guys. If we can keep these two alive, I'm very impressed. And again, these are also ranged. So, are you going to attack my hero now? That appears to be the case. We are in the forest too, though. Oh, they're retreating. Oh, that's excellent. Heals itself, but um, all of you attack one target. 48 damage. 
This might be doable at this rate. Oh yeah, they should die from the hero attacking now. They're not dead, they're at two hit points. At least they're still attacking my hero first. Minus 34. Plus 34. Um, yeah, please do it like this. Kill this thing first. Not dead. They might kill it. They will kill it. Yay, one down, one to go. Hopefully a bit lucky. We are so low on health, it's incredible. Minus 27, what are you doing? You're not advancing, which should allow us to kill them now. Yeah, they are dead. Luckily. So, whew. Tough fight. Everyone survives at with the skin over their teeth. And we do get a mission complete with the demons in our own territory. Which is good as well. There we go. Mission complete. Extremely low health. Congratulations. All the villages are now pacified in my home region. So search that tile. Produce 40 industry in one of your cities for 10 turns to gain 15 influence. Well, we are definitely going to be retreating from this territory right now. And going to take the fastest way home as well. Wow. Um, what we need... Oh yeah. We can now actually assimilate the demon faction. Demons, they generate energy not from food, but from fire. They live in cold, dry, relatively barren areas. Their form is defined by very dense and resistant skeleton armor at which energies of fire and dust coalesce. Plus 5% influence per pacified Kazanji village on city. Pretty good. That is if you incorporate them into your faction. That's the idea behind uh, assimilation. You make them a part of your faction. And right now, they are also providing one bonus worker in our capital. So that, that if I do it like this, that actually does pull it down to three turns. Ready to assimilate. Well, we don't have the influence to assimilate them though, which is a shame. And my home ar main army can now start reaching. I think that's where the um, red army is, actually. And that's what it's showing. That exclamation mark. And at least our units heal every turn. Not a lot. Only three hit points healed. Jesus, that's nothing. But at least in two turns, we are expanding our capital by three more tiles. As well as one... Home base tile and the Empire Mint has been researched. Very good. I would like to get the Shaman. Wow, they have low health. They have low health and they are support. So they will give buffs instead of anything else. Um, do we have any sort of luxury in our territory? I don't see any. We might have some down. No, here's something. No, nope, that's just an anomaly. So you have anomalies, which are tile improvements that make the tiles better. And then you have resources like the dice that are over here, which are good. And there is also strategic resources. Over here we have glass steel. There's also titanium in the first eras. Later eras unlock different kinds of stuff. You know what? I want that mill foundry for more production. Sewer system, useful. Empire Mint, very, very useful. Also, seed storage. I like all of them. But we'll end our turn for now. And city expands. Very well. Gets us that burrow situated there. And 3 plus 1, indeed. 3 from the city and 1 from pacified cities. Um, you're healing a bit better now. Hopefully there's no roaming army coming from these guys over here. And we're just moving back home. Gonna finish up my um, exploration mission. Our, uh, the quest system, imminent empire plan. Every 20 turns you are allowed to change the way your 
empire runs itself. And yeah, let's just go and check out this ruin over here next turn. And it, it adds bonuses like increased signs, increased money, uh, increased military strength or vision on units and stuff. It's quite useful, really. And let's do a search. We'll also finish. New quest added. The second mouse. One of the armies roaming in Avron has the treasure that you seek. And also, you marvel at the work of the ancient. It's time to explore and learn Saint ancient sites. We've had some... Uh, oh, Titan Bones, which allows us to boost our city's production tremendously for 10 turns. Echoes of the past. Time and experience bring knowledge... Though new knowledge is not always welcome. Your dream of a great new tower to the stars, a symbol to Gaia, has been put off by strikes and riots at the building site. A Chakadai, who leads the Sakwa, claims your dreams are foolish sacrilege. He and many others continue to insist on the old ways. There are those, however, who have seen what you have seen and question the old ways as you do. As you do. You must explore, go farther, learn more. You convince them to look beyond the forest to seek new ways. It is time to explore farther. New regions should be explored and a new city founded. That should lead your people to believe that your vision for the Wild Walkers is more than just a dream. Give your people optimism and new purpose by founding a city in a new region. Grow the city so it provides a solid source of industry. Spread out your force and find the new perfect region to colonize. Create an army with a settler, go to an unknown region and use the colonize army mission. Okay. Uh, luckily, we'll have a settler in two turns already, so... Probably gonna put it down in this zone because... Rumbling Stones is production... Yeah, that's this is just a, a silly good location for a city here. Here on this coast, also the skate specimens and everything. So I like that spot a lot. Ah, more stuff. Minor faction haunts. Huh. Okay, well, let's avoid them for now. We're still recovering. So our settler is being built. You can only have one city per region, so this entire region is ours already, as you can see by the purple border. Empty construction queue, which is good for now. Geothermal pit, research and production. But that's about all there is in this area, what we can see at least, yeah. And oh man, we need to extend our city towards these moss pearls quickly. So let's actually um, create an army with our set. Or also, let's build both the Empire Mint and the Seed Storage for now in three turns. So our settler, you are going to go to this region. There's also the cold grassland with the clay here. So if I just settle a city right here, that's an amazing spot. That is a really good spot. And we'll use uh, extend our city at least towards the black earth and towards more production. Oh yeah, we're going to settle there next turn. And let's end this one. The second mouse, one of the armies of, oh. In Evron. Good question. Where would that be? Um, yes, you guys settle me this city right here. To sustain your dream, you will need to produce 25 production in your new city, which gives us the research visions of glory for free. Um, I think it's a what? Yeah, it's a Wild Walker specific research. Plus five influence when a city improvement is built on wild walkers. When a plus five when a region improvement is built on wild walkers. Just just straight up. Ah, interesting. So you just get straight up influence when you build one of those things. Um, Empire Mint would take eleven turns. Everything is eleven turns right now. So we'll just start on the seed storage. And since we see this entire area now, I am going to explore a bit more though, because there has to be a neutral faction over here. With them. Wow, orange is already at 100 points. Yeah, we are falling behind, but we have settled the second city early. I mean, before turn 20, that's freaking early. 
Hero level up. I like that. Plato has leveled up. Um, more movement on units, plus one vision on garrison. Extra. Yeah, I want to get to staggered blows. More attacks. So we'll get that for now. There are multiple routes to each side. Oh, hello. There are some neutral baddies over here. They can, of course, reinforce with what's in the um, village there. Geysers. Oh, wow. This region is freaking good. One turn for the mint. More money. 24 per turn now in dust. And population evolution. Yeah, our second city has evolved. You know what? We're going to parlay. See if they want to join us peacefully in some way. Bring back 10 glass steel. Um, we cannot trade yet on the market, which is a shame. But we need to bring back the glass steel. Let's go to these ruins next turn, actually. Empire plan is available. Uh, more science, more dust. We can do two of them, I think. Yeah, it's... No, wait, what? Really? It's... How is this cost? Each new city will increase the cost. Oh, okay, so more cities is more expensive. Well, for now, um, we don't have anyone on dust anyway. So, this city is just growing at the moment. Let's get one on production, though. Yeah, let's just only get this... No, we're not doing anything for the Empire plan for now. We're just going to save up our influence. Um, with noble empire such as yours, the future of Origa is assured. Let's search this ruin. Yeah, they're finally almost recovered. Five glass steel. Oh, that's a start. Now we need just five more. Mill foundry in one turn. And we can build that in our capital, get even more production going. Perfect. The mill foundry. Are you or are you not going to attack me is my question. We'll search this ruin as well. 30 dust. Always nice. So you, I kind of want the mill foundry. I also want two more archers. And let's just rush the foundry then there. I would like to do the same here actually. Rush it for more production. It's a little bit expensive. Oh, of course, we need to set up research as well. Yeah, let's uh, actually research the exploitation for titanium and glass steel. So we can actually work it, even though we don't appear to have any yet. No foundries have been built. A good, a good way to... Ah, we can... We can see armies in adjacent regions. I think that is one of our specialties. Yeah, indeed. That's why we see these exclamation marks. And I haven't seen them before because I haven't played the Wild Walkers before this one. Let's go to our other city for now. Let's see what's up. And get an archer into my army. A second one. We want archers. Yes, dismiss. Um, new army. Army just joined the other one. Uh, transfer units to a nearby army. Or just move them in there. There we go. Uh, let's actually see what's up in this region. Oh, what do we have here? More of the demons. Hmm. Could try and pacify them, but... If I pacify them, they won't be sending out roaming armies anymore. Uh, yes, good. You built your seed thing. Also, let's get our burrow, our first one, adding 10 production to the city. That will take 8 turns to construct. Adding 10 plus what we already have here. Yeah, that's. this is going to be an incredible city. I can have a feeling about that. Uh, let's parlay and see what they want. Um, return to the village where you're ready to give them a hundred dust. Well, that will be next turn. Simple as that. Construction, we already added new one. And population evolution is also quite appealing. We'll have another archer going on. 
There we go. Empty construction. Parlay. There we go. You pleased? Bring here with 10 glass steel to the other Kazanji. Oh, damn it. Now I actually need to find glass steel and settle that. Galdiras. Oh, God. Those are also quite strong units. They are... In Iceworks and demons are both quite annoying to deal with. Well, they're not sieging my city, at least. Let's create a new army for now and meet up over there. Uh, yeah, you cannot move more this turn. Also, sewer system would make them a lot more happy. It's only a single turn, and we'll also build another one of these. Um, we could use some more production. Oh, but I want to go get the mossy there, mossy stuff over here, the moss pearls. So it's a good idea to expand that direction. Anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep updated in the future. And here you can see the red people, the ardent mages have also expanded. You know what? I'll see you guys later.